Hello guys, Pivot Man here, and I'm going to be showing you how to make a TIE Fighter from the new Star Wars movie. Um, you're going to need red wool, black wool, gray wool, light gray wool, a button, leather brick stairs, black stained glass, dispenser, and droppers. Okay, we are going to go off the ground some so we can actually make it up there. Okay, this should be enough. Now I need break all of these let's see there we go now you are going to go over here go one two three four five six then go to the other side one two three four five six once you get done with that switch over to your light gray wool do those four make the plus sign then fill in those corners with a black wool one oh I messed that up there we go. Then you are gonna make these go one, two, three, so that it's a diagonal line. Um, do those for every corner, as I am doing so on screen. While I'm doing this on screen, I'm gonna say a very bad joke. You wanna know why Yoda is a good gardener? Because he has a green thumb. Okay, once you get it done with that, you're going to stack that about that high, which is three high. One, two, three down. Then you're going to come to these corners and make like a half plus sign for each corner. Um, just like that. Then once you're done doing that, if I can ever stop messing up, you go one out. Then you Go all the way across, make sure that they aren't touching, like they're slanted away. Do that for every side, making a TIE Fighter wing shape. Once you are done with that, make every side out one from the middle. Well, not out one, but out from the middle to the wing, the main body of the wing. Sorry, I haven't done it for this side. I think I might have forgot, but yeah, I'm going to it right now. I build that up, yep. Now what you want to do, once you have this base, switch over to the light gray wool, and fill in all of the spaces that are not filled in. While you are filling this in, you could like come yourself a tomb, like maybe the Star Wars tomb or something. Don't want to do that because I don't want to get a copyright and then get this removed. There we go. There we go. There we go. Should be finishing up here soon. Now I am on to the last one. There we go. Now you are going to take buttons, make, put them all from the middle, like the fours, the left one, the right one, um, the up one, and the diagonal ones, but not like on the outer rims and like, unless it's in those angles. Once you are done with the buttons on the outsides of the wing, um, you are going to switch on to the inside of the wing then put buttons the same way Make it give more of a texture like if you've seen the Lego ones. They have more like that texture um, But once you guys are done with the each like once you guys are done with the inside and outside of these wings with buttons um, You are going to do the exact same thing to the and the other wing, um, I'm going to cut that out because that would take too long. Um, so yeah, I'll be back with you guys when we are done with the other wing. So I guess I'll be right back. Okay guys, once we are back, you will take your light gray wool, go one, two, out, switch over to the black. Go make a little plus sign again right here. Don't worry guys, this isn't, this isn't more wings. Then you are going to do what I am doing right now. Make it like that, then like that, like that, like that. 
then add on little tips to each of them so you have like this weird shape then break each of the insides give it that effect of a TIE fighter do the same to the other side but do the plus sign in black wool then you guys switch over to red wool give it that movie TIE fighter kind of look how it is in the movie because in the movie it has that TIE fighter look that is just really cool once you are done with that, we are going to start with the main body. Switch back to the black wool. Go one, two, three. Go down to the bottom of the little plus sign that we just made. Well, the second one. Then go across. Go back up. Then connect it. Do the same for the red side. Lastly, we have to put gray corners right there because we don't want it black or red in the middle. Then we are going to do the red side, the exact same as the black side. Then once you are done with the red side, you will um, switch over to your gray wall. Go down, down, and then down again. Make Cover that little hole up. And I believe you will switch over to red stained glass. Let me just get that real fast. Probably replace the buttons. You'll need those. Um, then make it like I am. Once you're done with that, go on to the other side. Switch to black glass. Then make it like the black window. Two layers of black glass. And a layer of red. When you're done with that, break these two blocks, make it look like a plus sign, and then go up one, one side with the black, gray, um, I actually messed up here, but I guess I didn't notice it, that gray one that I just placed on the red side is supposed to be red, then break that middle one, go and get yourself a, um, trap door, probably place the, mm, resting glass, then put that on the top block, already looks like it. Once you were you will open up the trap door then you will lower down in there um, do as I do make like a little staircase place fill in these holes break this no beam that you had that was just to give you a area that you can build from um, whoops wrong block I think I might have messed this up right there, yep. Um, yeah, make the make sure that the trapdoor is on the other side so that your ladder will allow you to go up. Um, mine down. Yeah, put that right there. Put a, no, yeah, put another staircase right there and then put the nether brick stairs. Fill in these two little holes right here. Another nether brick stairs right there. Then, oh, wrong block to break. You want to go and get yourself a lever. You put it right there. That's like the joystick for the gunner pilot. Same for the flyer pilot. Get some redstone torches and that dramatic effect of redness inside the tie fighter. Put that on both sides right there. Yep, now I'll fill in all these holes they have from earlier. Make it look nice and solid. Break that. Look, yep, right there. Then fill in that hole also. Make sure you guys don't miss those holes. Um, so I guess that's your TIE Fighter. All you have left to do now is bring out a ladder, make that go up so you can get in it now in survival. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like and subscribe for more Minecrafter tools. And I guess I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.